Welcome back, my dear light bulbs, to another Samurai discussion. If you're a new viewer to my channel, remember to subscribe so you become part of the light bulb army. So I will be talking about Hashimaru and Hashimaru potentially being named after a Japanese myth, and that is Hashiman. So in, I'm going to read the description in Wikipedia. It says, in Japanese beliefs, Hashiman, also known as Yahata no Kami, is a syncretic divini divinity of archery and war, incorporating elements from both Shinto and Buddhism. Although often called the god of war, he is more correctly defined as the tutelary god of warriors. He is also the divine protector of Japan, the Japanese people, and the imperial house, the Minamoto clan, and most samurai worship him. The name means God of Eight Banners. Now, we do know that Hachi in Japanese means eight. So it makes sense that Hachiman, you know, the number eight is going to be in his name. God of Eight Banners, referring to the eight heavenly banners that signal the birth of the divine emperor Ojin. His symbolic animal messenger is the dove. Now, I read all of this and I believe that, yes, Hashimaru might have been named after this god because... Hishimoto is taking a lot of elements in Samurai 8 from like Buddhism and other religions and stuff and there's nothing wrong with that and it's really cool because it just goes into the fact that Kishimoto is doing his research a lot of research a lot of folklore and stuff in Samurai 8 and I really am enjoying that aspect of the series now Hashiman the name means god of eight banners eight banners right so Hashimaru is the eighth key of Pandora's box and Mandala's box. Obviously, you only need seven keys, but he's an extra key, right? And eight banners. Now, some people are speculating that Hashimaru will have samurai armor, like his samurai armor will have like eight arms or something. That would be insane if he could have eight arms with his samurai armor. Or maybe if Hashimaru gets another holder in the future, because we do know his holder is Hayataru, which he has a close connection with. Now, we don't know if a holder... I believe, no, we do know. I believe a holder gets stronger as the samurai gets stronger. So I believe Hayataro will get stronger. And there might be a possibility that Hayataro actually evolves into something else. And if that's the case, maybe in like critical battles, Hayataro changes its form into this eight, you know, eight arm type of beast. That would be awesome and assist Hashimaru in their battles. Now we have seen... Ata's holder, we have seen Daruma's holder, we have seen Hanaichi's holder, and other holders in the series, Benkei's holder. And it would be really cool if Hayataro, like I was saying, turns into like a gigantic holder with eight arms and Hashimaru just enters Hayataro and controls it. That would be insane. And maybe even form some samurai soul blades with the arms or maybe like some blades with the eight arms that would be really cool to see to what i was saying so archery and war that's hashiman so some people brought up that with archery it could be the pistols that the Kongo Yasha school license gives you and stuff and i believe that hashimaru will be really good using his pistols as well you know if his samurai soul sword gets knocked down he's like oh that's not all I have. And then he pulls out the dual pistols and starts um, spraying with them and stuff and has really good accuracy. So that would be really interesting. I don't know if Hashimaru will become a God of War like this title kind of suggested, but um, the Hashiman title is also the name of, from the myth. He's also divine protector of Japan. I believe obviously the Hashimaru is the divine protector of the world of Samurai. So I hope you enjoyed this discussion video. And if you did, remember to have a great day. Peace.